Hi guys, welcome to another episode of Night Watches Paranormal Brisbane. Where are we, Shannon, tonight? We are at the home of the Red Ghost tonight. So we're at my old house doing one last hurrah, hurrah! to all the spirits that are here. <laughs> yeah. um, so we're going to do a live tonight. So we'll show you the footage from there as well if you weren't able to join. Yep. And hopefully we get some good stuff come through. Crossing fingers, yeah. So. See what we get tonight, guys. So, oh, before we go, don't forget to like, subscribe, and of course, share the, share the content out. Share the content out. Let's go and um, see what we get. Are we live? Hello. Yeah. <laughs> Hi. Alright, we'll we wait have. for people to jump on. Yes. Come on to look here. Hi, right, welcome. We'll just give it a few minutes for those who are joining us for the first time. This is our first live at Night Witches Paranormal Brisbane. Don't mind Shannon drinking some, you know, <laughs> much needed to... Getting some hydration. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Yeah, we only got here about Andrea. Hello, Hi, Andrea. Andrea. How are you? Yeah, we're just we got here about five ten minutes ago. So yeah, traffic was a bit uh, rough for Shannon to pick me up. Hexy. Yeah. So we haven't really prepared ourselves much. So <laughs> we're winging it. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, this is uh, just letting you guys know. I told this to the moderator group. Uh, Andrea, you all know this. We plan on the investigation. Hello, Chrissy, how are you? Planning to do an experiment with a fidget spinner because the bearings are so easy to spin. We'll just see if anything in here would move it. We'll find out. Oh yeah, by the way, once when we got here, you had yeah, something went, strange happen. <laughs> so I went to wash my hands in the bathroom and the yeah. tap was actually hot. Yes. Um, the first water that came out was hot water, like someone had used it, so it was a bit weird. Hey Dad! Oh. Chris, that's my dad. Hello! <laughs> yeah. Hello Shannon's dad, nice to meet you. <laughs> um, yeah, so it was hot water pouring out, which is a bit odd, because mm. no one has used it as far as I know. And yeah, as she, as um, Shannon told me she was here at 9 o'clock this morning. Yeah, early this morning. Yeah, and she mopped the floors, didn't she? Or whatever. Yeah, yeah. 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 whatever. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All the fun stuff. Yeah. And um, yeah, that tap should be hot. No, that. And uh, even if the real estate came yeah. in, they were here yeah. at four, so it still shouldn't be as hot as it was. Mm. Um, so it'll be interesting to see if we do actually get anything today. Yeah. Ta da! <laughs> Shannon just starting for cat ball. So the window behind you is closed, guys, so it won't move the blinds or anything. Okay. You stream under a light. Mm -mm. And it's alive. Oh, yeah, that's a thing. That is true. Well, we may not be using this one. <laughs> we might not use that one because, yeah. Interesting. Let me just try over here. <laughs> no, it is not. Can you see the lights on there? Yep. Yeah. We're just, it's, obviously when there's something live, we know the KG just goes crazy. Hi like Denise. That. Hello Denise, how are you? So yeah, we're sort of trying to keep this as far away from Shannon's mobile phone until we're using it at the moment. It wouldn't be picking up the metal bars or anything on the window, would it? Nope. No. Oh, maybe. Um, Oops. Sorry. Right, <laughs> trying to be gentle. That's all. Hmm. Put that down. <laughs> I'm not having any success with this apple. Leave it, uh, leave it on the ground. Do, 
is put this phone on airplane mode. It's one thing I always will try that without you know, my phone on. No, it's still going mad, phone. absolutely mad. There it goes. Can you touch it again, please? For all the spirits and the entities in the house, we're going to try and communicate with you tonight. So you know me, I lived here. And this here is Alistair. Hi, nice to meet you. We're just here to have a chat and see if you can talk to us at all. And we do come in love, peace and respect as well. We're a friend of Shannon's, here to help communicate. Can you put all of your energy into that device? Can you grab it and put it all the way up to the orange and the red? To let us know you're here? It's trying. It is. Well, Can you step away from it for me, please? Step back away from it and take it back to the green. Things that wasn't flashing when I'm here. It wasn't, yeah, when you were here 30 seconds ago. Mm. But we did get a bit of activity right, yeah. um, pretty much where your camera is. Yeah. But it was at the end of the table at about child height. Yeah. With the, I think it was the music box and stuff. Mm. When Dan remember, and Pete yeah. were here. Yeah. Because um, I remember the video was pointing this direction. The video was yeah. pointing that way was, towards yeah. the window. Yeah. Um, music box was that way. It was pointing yeah. into here and there was a desk here across the middle. As far as I know, there's no wiring in that wall at all. Um, so I yes. don't know why it would be going off. Yeah. Definitely nothing here. The only other thing is potentially the internet cable, but that is switched off at the moment, so yeah. it's not even plugged into any power. Okay, so we're getting some activity even though we haven't technically started and even done any filming yet. <laughs> My camera's there, as you can see. <laughs> so can I see the cat ball down there? In the corner, yep. Yeah. If there's any spirits here, can you please touch this cat ball that's on the floor here? Um, yeah, Denise, we are at um, my old house, so the house that we're moving out of at the moment, because we have had a lot of previous activity here over the two years that we've lived here. Um, and while I'm talking, that's going crazy. Yes. Are you responding to me? Oh, that'd be interesting. <laughs> um, okay, distracted, completely yes. distracted. If I don't have a watch, I've ruled that out a few times. <laughs> there you go. I have a watch, yeah. Oh, hello. Whoever's here, if you can concentrate all your energy and push it to the red. Push really hard. Please. Be nice. <laughs> Can you touch that device for me? Let me know you're here. Or move the ball that's in the corner near Alice's feet. You know these ones, they light up. Are you annoyed that we're leaving? 
or are you happy to get a peaceful house back? That's just it. Hmm. We might maybe move down the hallway and see if we get yeah. anything in there. Yeah. Alright, so for a little bit of context, guys, we, or I have had um, dark shadows move up against this, this wall here, um, watching from in the master bedroom, which is the corner door. We've had activity in the boys' rooms, which is the first door there, and no one is really in the spare room, but we've had noises and stuff come from there when, when there's been no one in it. So if there's anyone here with us, can you touch one of those devices, please? You might remember seeing them when Dan and Pete came to visit. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> My mum's on and she's just said, now you tell me I slept in that room. <laughs> that, was, that was our guest bedroom. All right, if there's anyone here, please come and move this cat ball like that to make it light up in colours. And there's a grey box here, please inter interact and make the lights move. It was me always heard sound in here. It's not like footsteps, but anyway. <laughs> yeah, that's what I usually hear in that room. Yeah? Yeah, footsteps. Okay. Yeah, because I just I was hearing something now and I was like, what the? That's a frog, the little like no. chirp. No, I had a droplet of water. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh yeah. live stream boys. <laughs> yeah. There we go. That's better. <laughs> oh. Don't be here. What am I doing? I'll get the necrophonic out. Alright, so we're going to bring out a device that you can speak to us on. You can use your energy to come through nice and loud and clear for us. As I said, you know me. My name's Shannon. No. That always creeps me out. And this is Alistair. Hello, how are you? And we just wanted to communicate with you. Okay. I don't know if you can see that. Have you put the phone down there? Okay. Gonna start it? Oh my god. Alright. So if you are here with us. Oh, your voice. Can you let us know your name, please? Can you see that clearly enough, guys? <laughs> Rosalind <laughs> says that's so creepy. Hi, Chris. Now, the, I heard footsteps in the back room there. <laughs> Was that you? That sounded like Henry. Is there a Henry here? Can you... Can you come through and say your name again? Yes. Are you sad that we're leaving?
the red ghosts come through. The red ghosts we've actually worked out are connected to my son. I have a theory that they might be his spirit guides helping him through situations. And is there a young girl still here? Was that a hello? Yeah. Young girl? That's what it sounded like. Um. To the young girl that's here, can you tell us your name? Hey, Simon. That sounds like a Possibly. I use I use sad that I'm Shannon and the family are moving on. <coughs> Sounded like a brief yes, I'm not too sure. What? I don't know. I'll say it again. Are you sad that Shannon and the family have moved out now? Brilliant. Brilliant. Andrea said she thought she heard Amy. Okay. Fear. Amy, are you here? Fish? Yeah, I heard fish. What? <laughs> This really like Aussie sounding one that just said hi. Hi, how are you mate? Hey Chris, that's right, we've just gotten started. <laughs> okay, we'll try a direct question. <laughs> living uh, in this house now? Can you come through one at a time, please? Water. That just sounded like water. Mm. <laughs> Were you the one that affected the water earlier? When Shannon... Oh. Yeah. Jeez. That sounded like a yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Closer? Closer? Yeah. Yeah. Do any of you have any questions? Can you tell me the name of one of the little boys that used to live here? That sounded like Edgar. I thought it sounded like Edgar. Oh, I didn't hear that. Can, can you say it nice and clear for us, please? It is, yeah. What the hell was that? <laughs> help? Do you need help? Forgive. Forgive. What do you need forgiveness for? 
Great. Andrea heard a yelp when we asked if it played with William. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I heard. Yeah. That's what I thought I heard too. Can you manipulate the K two so that yeah. gray, that grey box? That's only one. Sound like a little little girl. Yeah. Can you make the lights go all the way to orange? Can you tell me how many people lived here? Can you tell me how many living people lived here? Four. 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 That was really that? clear. Yeah, that was four. Thank you, little girl. Are you are you sad that we're moving? Three. Are you Are you happy to stay here? <laughs> That sound like leave. Do you do you want us to leave? Yeah. I'll say again. What was that? I don't know. Do you want us? Do you want us to leave? Yes. Uh, Sounded like a yes. Uh, We're just here to communicate with you for a little while. We'd love to see if you can give us some evidence that you're here. Pressing on my chest? Mm -hmm. What were you trying to tell us? Did that say boy? Sorry. Any questions? Is there four spirits in the house? That was unnerving. <laughs> <laughs> that was. <laughs> Okay. Is there four spirits in this house? Good. Mm. Can you tell us how many spirits are in this house? What was that? I don't know. That was creepy. Five? Five? Can you say that clearly, hey. please? Hey, hey. Hey, hey. Come on, here. You remember me, please? Do you remember me? What? Yeah. Yeah, one of you touched me on the shoulder. Yeah. What was on the leg? <laughs> Do you remember him? Chris heard five ghosts. So for quite a while, we had a lot of um, different entities coming in and out. 
Um, so, are the five that here that are here? Are you the original? Yeah. Yes. Yes. Sound like a few kisses in the room. Yes. Did you live here? Um, if the little girl that's here, can you touch that cat ball there, please? Make it light up in pretty colours. I know you'll enjoy that. Sound like ghost. Chris, uh, yes, I think there was. Um, I did close down the mirrors. Uh, she's just asked if there was a portal in the house. I closed down the mirrors uh, probably about a, two or three weeks after Pete and Dan came down. Um, and a lot of the activity stopped. So I think there was an open channel through one of the mirrors in the bathroom. Is there any spirits in the room that behind the speaker in this room where I'm pointing? In the spare bedroom. I heard footsteps in there briefly. Mandy just said it's like they're all trying to come through together and discussing amongst each other, then answering your questions. I can almost imagine people standing right there. It's amazing. Um, Mandy, that's exactly what it was like when Pete and Dan came down as well. It was like they were discussing things with themselves. And in all of the like ghost tube um, sessions and stuff that I've done by myself, it's exactly like that. It's like they're having a conversation between themselves and um, completely ignoring us and our questions like it's an afterthought. Hi. Hi. Do you reckon we should maybe stop it? Unless there's any questions you guys have? Um, Christy's just asked, yep. do, they, do they miss... Do you miss my family being here? Sorry. Sorry? Okay, no. Can you come through? Can you come through? Please. Can you come through one at a time, please? Yes. No, yes. I heard no, then yes. Is there a hierarchy amongst you? Yep. Yep. Can the one who's in charge please come forward and speak to us? No. Out of peace, love, and respect, we will Hi, David. Hi, David. Kid. Which? Did you hear it say which? Yeah, I heard that. <laughs> Did you hear it say which, guys? Because technically you are almost oh, practicing one, aren't you? Yeah, they got that right. <laughs> Actually, do you reckon we should try the pendulum? Give that a go? We can, yeah. we can try. Yeah. If you're up for it. Do it. That sounded like do it. Okay. <laughs> that quite seriously sounded like something being dragged across the floor through the speaker. Um, Alright guys, we're okay. going to give a pendulum a go. And we'll see how steady my hand can be. <laughs> David asked the question, how does a pendulum work? Um, it'll work different for everyone. My last pendulum used to, um, 
swing back and forward in one direction um, to tell me yes and back and forward in the other direction to tell me no. But this one here seems to swing back and forth. So just so you can see it, it's hanging on a hook there. Um, so it swings back and forth to say yes and then around to say no. But at the start of every session, I like to ask out and just confirm, can you show me yes? And depending on the energies that are around, yeah, Daniel's right, it works with um, energy pools. Um, so depending on how strong the energy around is, it may take a while to start moving. And if it's a really strong energy or entity interacting with it, it can swing quite quickly. So to give you a bit of an idea, guys, I usually use the pendulum to interact with my spirit guides. Um, and to do that, I hold it so that it's, it's using my energy. So I'm not sure how well it's going to interact being hung on its own. So you'll also see that we've got the cat ball and fidget spinner. So for any of the entities here, especially the little girl, if you can move the ball or spin that little toy on the table, on the bench, just to let us know that you're here with us. You're welcome to draw off of my energy. And mine as well. Yeah. Dan just said that Pete's up this weekend to film for Nightwatches Paranormal Australia, which is super exciting. Mm -hmm. Where are they going this weekend? <laughs> yeah. Andrew's just asked what stone, I cannot remember for the life of me which stone that is. <laughs> um, I think it might be a blue calcite, but don't quote me on that one. To the spirits that are here, can you come into the kitchen and interact with us? I know you've turned that light on before, I'd love to see you do it again. Yeah, as you said, Sharon, that light here, you told me earlier that just randomly comes on. Yeah, yeah, so it started a few times, Jimmy, and you actually have to connect these two to turn on like that. bits to turn it on. So it's in frame for these guys here, they'll see it. Yeah. If it does happen. To the little girl that's here, can you come and interact with us, please? Or can you knock on a wall? <laughs> yeah, Chris, it doesn't seem like they want to play today. It's it's really quite strange because when we yeah. were living here, we got a lot more like a lot more activity in the front of the house. But I think that's because while we were living here, I set the boundaries that they weren't to go into the bedrooms. That yeah. that was sort of off limits. But now that we've left, there's a lot more activity back in the bedrooms. It's like they've taken it over again. <laughs> if the spirits are here, tap on the walls for us like this. <coughs> Not getting much movement on that pendulum. Do you hear whistling? Yeah, briefly. Unless that's outside. Oh, that'd be the key yeah. to press the road. Yeah. We're trying to be careful with the noise pollution because it's still neighbours, obviously. So we might end the live here, guys, and we'll do an investigation in the bedrooms. And you'll have to hang out and wait and see the edited video for that one. That's it. So wandering around, I haven't yeah. actually had anything.
so we're going to go for a walk, guys. Whoop. That flick it a bit. Mm. Hello, backyard. I've got the light on out the back. Okay. Um, that door through there as well is the one that opened. Yeah, oh yeah. Um, yeah, so Shannon said it's... that door opened on her and Chris. Yeah, well, more three, Chris. three yeah. separate times. Mm. There's no spikes at all. No. no. It's a bit dark in here, but it's okay. A little bit, a little bit dark. Going back into Shannon's old bedroom, which is completely dark. There's like absolutely nothing. It's almost like they've just bugged it off. Mm. Used to spend a lot of time keeping my sons awake. Are you still here? Next was dog. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Nothing. Is there anyone here with us? Can you touch this box in my hand? Let me know you're here. Weirdly, I'm not a fan of having my back to the door. Hmm. <laughs> well, that's how I was feeling when I was there, briefly. Yeah. Just really quiet. Dead silent. Mm. But it was so active last night. Yeah. Probably because I was here alone and they were like mm. messing. Is there anyone here with us? Or have you all gone into hiding? You know you can't follow us to the new house, you have to stay here. Can you tell me which room you're in? We'd like to get some answers before we go. Nothing. Maybe we do a voice recorder and see how we go. Yeah. Hmm. Are you doing like... Where do you think we should? Yeah, that's where I was standing when we're doing the live, but. Like, even over here, it's not. Like, not reacting now. No. And you, you were far enough away from the camera, like this. And there's absolutely no electricity in this side of the room. No. There's definitely nothing, guys, as you can see. Oh. That could have been me bumping it, maybe. Yeah, it is a bit um, sensitive to bumping. Just a little. Maybe not. I don't know. Because I know my ring hit it. Yeah. Are you trying to avoid us now? Do you want me to bring out the ghost tube? Ah. If you want me to bring the ghost tube back out, can you spike it right up to the orange for me? I know you've done a lot of your interaction with me through the through ghost you. Were you talking to my phone? It's gone here. Yeah. Hmm.
Am I holding what? it too high? Is that what the problem is? No. Can you touch it? If the little girl's here, can you please touch that, please? No, nothing. I'm, I'm just not getting anything, unfortunately. I'm not feeling anything. Not feeling anything. Mm. What do you reckon? Do a voice recording? <laughs> yeah, I reckon yeah. Um, just in the entrance of the main bedroom, maybe. Yeah. Well, if you face it away from us, then it'll pick up anyone. Yeah, because it's okay. directional, so here, 90 degrees, like that? No. Yeah. Okay. All right, I started recording. So, is there anyone here with us at the moment? Is the little girl here with us still? There's a thump from next door. Hmm. And all the sand should be coming from this direction though. Yeah. Um, to the little girl that is here, can you tell us your name? If you talk into this microphone, it will let Alice to hear what you're saying. Are you happy that... Oh, I should say, are you sad that Shannon is leaving or has left the house? Are you happy to have the house back to yourselves now? There is external noise happening as well. Yeah, I'm hearing a plane. Yeah. <laughs> um, are you going to be happy to live with the next tenants that move in? There's still the plane going overhead. No, I thought I heard a little whistle though. It's know. very faint. Can you do that again, please? Are you happy that someone else will be moving in? Do you have any say over who moves into the house? Are you able to influence that in any way? I thought I had a moan. There was outside, a kid yelling outside. Mm, it sounded like a little moan. In the distance it could be wrong. Like I'm recording us, we can hear it back. Is there... That's dripping. Is there anybody here that wants to talk to us at the moment? If you come and talk to this microphone, Alistair will be able to hear what you're saying. Did you hear it click that no. way? Or was it that the drip? It was oh. a drip. Yeah. I'm just turning up the gain on here a little bit. 
Might be a bit too late, but we'll see. Okay, now I'm hearing everything. Oh, That's all. Hmm. That's only on eight. <laughs> Is there anyone here that wants to talk to us? Did you just hear a meow? If you can tap on a wall. If you can tap on the wall like this. Or manipulate this device. We know you can do it, you've done it before. Are there any of my spirit attachments here? To any of the entities in the house, do you know that you have to stay here? You can't follow me. You can't follow Alistair. You do not have permission. Are you happy to stay here? Are you in the lounge room now? If you're in the lounge room, can you give a knock on the wall? Maybe move the blinds. Just me, sorry. Is the person that tried to lock me out here? Do you like playing tricks on people? So one of the incidences that happened was I was trying to unlock the front door mm -hmm. and it was like there was a full body weight leaning up against the other side. I could not get in for the life of me. Okay. Um, and then it, I was like shoving and pushing against the unlocked door and finally it just gave out and just opened. Eesh. Like it sticks to the point where you have to kick it, but that was like I was shoving all of my weight against it and it yeah. wouldn't open. So... It was a bit of a weird one and I think about two days before one of my friends had the same thing happen to her yeah. in a different okay. location. Is there anybody that wants to talk to us? This is your last chance. We're going to be going soon. I'm going to try one last thing and that's to see if you can open or close that door out the back. Are you happy to try that? Because if it closes, you'll hear it. And I'm watching it too. Can you slam it shut for me? I heard something briefly before you said that, but I didn't. There's a bug flying around in the bathroom. We're going to go check out the back now. You're welcome to come and interact with us out there. Okay, I've just turned the voice recorder on auto, so probably not the best idea because I can hear everything now. What is this? Ouch. <laughs> it's a bit loud. 
What is this? This is a phone and a device that you can talk to us with. Are you from here? I used to live here, but you should know that. Is the little girl still here with us? You can talk to Alistair or you can talk through my phone. I know you've used it before. Hide now. Hide now. Hide. Where are you hiding? Are you trying to play hide and seek with us? That came up just as I panned the camera into the kids' room. Or are you telling us to hide? I'm just Madison. into the kids' bedroom. Madison? Is that your name? Can you repeat that? Judge. Judge. Sorry? Judge. Judge. Back on. Can see what you Good job. Might also pull out the S S L R. How do you feel? How do you feel? We're all right, thank you. How are you? I'm always concerned that that's like an inbuilt thing. Hmm. Because that's said it a few times. It almost always says it. Yeah, and there's absolutely nothing in here that the SLS would pick up. Yeah. Okay. Picking you up. Finish. Finish. We will be finished very soon. Just going for a walk in here. So it picks any. Did they just read the door? May have picked you because you're there. I'm just going to sneak into the boys' room. Is there anyone in here? Is okay. Madison in here? Can you play with this box? Huh. Make the lights light up? It's pick it, it picked up the pod tripod. <laughs> <laughs> and you now? And me. Uh, out of time. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh yeah, if you don't have premium, you can only record for like a minute. Yeah. Alright, try again. Um. What the? Oh, hello. Shannon. I'm recording it, but... What is that? It's not picking up the bars on the window, is it? I think it's picking up the bars on the window. Maybe. There is no bars here though. Oh. Garden. Garden. Are you in the garden? Purgatory. Purgatory? In the garden. Leash. Leash? Thanks. <laughs> and there's you again. Oh, hello. Medicine. Medicine? Now, just before I saw something flash next to you, 
Where I raised my hand? Yeah, but no, like at the bathroom door before. Mm. I'll show you on the video. We're we getting a film of a film of a... of an Alistair filming. Don't know. Tell me about it. Tell me about it. Okay, either it's just the latency, because I'm moving and it's like there's another figure next to you. Moving? That's weird. Well, I wasn't moving. No, no, when I moved the camera. Oh. Farther. Hi. Farther. Further. Further. Like, farther away. Okay, I'm going to tell this. talking about. Try again. Like just as I turned around to you. Thanks. <laughs> and there's you again. There. Oh, hey. That's a bit weird in yeah. the bathroom. And that's echoing. Is there <laughs> someone in the bathroom? How do I use it? How do you use what? What are you asking about? Picking up the door on the handle. Yeah. I was picking up the... Uh, the Greetings. Handle. Greetings. Hello. Who's here with us? Can you give a name? Other side. Other side. Other side is what it said. Other side of what? Are you the other side of the window? Are you outside in the garden? I need to go. I need to go. Okay. You're welcome to go. You just need to say goodbye. He's gone. Gone? No, oh, still there. Now I don't know if that's a reflection or it's picking up something. That was me just shifting the tripod too. Yeah. It's either picking me up or it's Mirror. It says Turn mirror. it off. Mirror. Turn Maybe. it off. Might be picking me up from the mirror. Shovel. Shovel? Ritual. Ritual. Yeah, that comes through all the time. Do you mean this mirror? Are you talking about this mirror? Whoop. It's picking you up. That's picking multiples of you. That doesn't sound like right. Is that because I'm holding the tripod? Maybe. No, it was like behind you. It's just picking up the basket there. Okay. Don't know why it said mirror, but I am going to sneak through.
the thing of that would open. So this is the door that, that opens from time to time on its own in the last few weeks. So if you can try and open the door again. You did it while Chris was watching. He said shovel before. Oh, uh, yeah. Look what's on the floor. Shovel, yeah. Can you open that door for me, please? Pull down on the handle. Who are you talking about? As you can see, there's the shovel. Can you let us know if you're still here? Are you happy to have the house to yourselves again? Heather, cemetery. Does that just flicker? Briefly. Heather, did you come with come home with me from a cemetery? Yes, I am holding a light, so I can see better. Can you turn these lights on for me? Touch the end here. Can you make this device turn up to the red for me? Is Timothy here? It's on dead again. Yeah. I've got like eight minutes left. <laughs> Where? Here in this house. Can you tell me how many people are here? Greetings. Hello, can you tell me how many people are here? How many living people are here? I'm hiding. Is that the before? Hmm. Grandfather. Grandfather. One of the red ghosts, a grandfather. Can you tell me your name? Disfigured. You've never had that conversation before. No. Can you tell me your name? Just got really muggy all of a sudden. Like mm. really horrible stuffy. What the? What the hell was that? Exactly. Uh, the garage doors open, there could be animals inside. Yeah. Sound like someone went like. I need to go. Like that. Oh. This just flickered. Did it? Is there anyone in the shed? If someone popped up here, I'd freak out right now. <laughs> Is there someone in the shed? 
Remade that noise. Remove the screw. Damage. What are you damaging? Got more interaction out here than we <laughs> had yeah. all night. In the house, yeah. There's a bug. So oh. it's literally just what's left of our storage stuff. That's if you can see anything. I can't see anything. In there, there so. yeah, you can see some of the tools and stuff mm. in there. But yeah, that was like someone went... Kicked something or... Yeah. Something like that. Because I put those there this afternoon. Yeah. Something like that, just like... Well, see, I thought it sounded like this thing moving. Mm. That's what I thought. No? No. Hey, Mr. Prementis. Like a, oh, I just walked through cobwebs. Mm. You were just standing here. Hmm? You were just standing here. How can there be spider webs? Well, I felt something on, on here. No, it must there be actually like... is. Yeah. I just pulled it off. Okay, that's okay. <laughs> Mr. Primatis, <laughs> can you tell us anything that's happening here? <laughs> Only crew ever that'll <laughs> interview a Primatis. Speak up. Speak up. Next minute. Uh huh. So, what is it like sticking around these past few days in this hot summer? Have you ripped any boys' heads off lately? That's what they do, don't they? <laughs> <laughs> picking up the tree. I'm picking up the tree. <laughs> There's a spirit in the tree. Yeah. See if we get anything in here. It's picking up that. Okay, it's picking up whatever's on there. Is that off of your tripod? Hmm? Nope. It's picking up that. We Goodbye. Just... Goodbye. Goodbye. Let's get the crap out of me. 46. 46. What does that mean? I don't know. What's 46? No, nothing. Got three minutes left and we haven't even done our intro. That's okay. <laughs> let's go back inside. Alright, let's go intro and outro and you're like, Yep. Goodbye. Show me no. Now it's working. So now it's in a circular pattern. Yeah. Are you an entity from the house? That's a yes. Can you tell me your name? Do you want to tell me your name? It's in your way. What turn us back on? Are you the little girl? No. No. Okay, I'm just gonna put that down. Are you the older gentleman that's been here for a while?
Can you tell me your name, please? Are you reluctant to tell me your name? Is using this drawing too much of your energy? That's a yes. It's very, very faint. Mm. Does that mean you can get it spins? No? No, that was me just no. settling it. Are you happy that we've left? You can draw on my energy to use these answers. And mine as well. Is that a yes that you're happy we've left? That is a sort of hesitant yes and no. Is that a maybe? Is there more than one spirit trying to interact with the pendulum? That's a pretty solid yes. Mm -hmm. Will you interact with it if I hang it back up? Obviously. Are you using my energy to interact? It's me moving. I got the voice recorder on as well, so it's been two minutes and twenty seven seconds. Are you using my energy to interact with the pendulum? Alistair's energy? Mm. I need something to lean on that's soft and bench. <laughs> I'll ask that again. I don't know if that's gonna help. That's gonna help. Are you are you using Alistair's energy to move the pendulum? This one's really awkward to hold. <laughs> <laughs> you can draw on our energy if you need to, to interact. Can one of you give me your name? It's almost like they're fighting over it. To the little girl, do you know how to spell your name? Yes. Can you tell me how many letters is in your name? So to the little girl, I'm going to start counting. Can you say yes when I get to the letter, uh, to the number of letters in your name? One, two, three, four, Is there four letters in your name? Is there three letters in your name? Mm, yes. 
Is your name Amy? Does your first name start with an A? So I think it was A. No. Stone spin. Does it is it a B? C D? I'm not thinking Lily. Is that what you said before? You said Amy before. Oh, Amy. And Madison came through. Is your name Lily? Oh, oh hang on. Is your name Lily? Is there, was it three, four letters? Three or four letters. Was it three letters? Is that a yes, there's three letters in your name? Yeah. Okay. Is the first letter A? B C D E F G H J K L That's me shaking. Oh. L M N O P Is the first letter of your name P? Is your name Peg? Peg, are you attached to the house? Can you push through really clearly, please? Peg, are you connected to me? Can you push through really clearly? I think I know who it is. Peg, are you connected to me? Thank you. Peg, are you my grandmother? My nana? Yes. 
Are you coming through as a little girl so you can interact with my children? Yes. That's pretty solid, yes. Yeah. And I'm not moving my hands, I'm not moving my fingers. And I'm holding onto the ball, not the chain. Yeah. I've run out of questions now. I'm kind of just overwhelmed. Um, Are you... Peg, are you protecting... Shannon's kids? Are you one of the red ghosts? No. But you are looking... Are you looking after Shannon? I feel weird calling her Peg, but Peg, are you, do you visit your sons? That's a yes. Definitely a yes. Okay. Um. You alright? Yeah. Can you tell me how many children you have? How many living children you have? Is it one? Two? Three? Four? Five? Six? Is it six? That looks like a six. Is that correct? Yeah. 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 Can you tell me how many sons you had? How many of your sons are still alive? Is there one? It's a no. Two, three, four, five, sorry, I have a shift. <laughs> Can you tell me again, is there four? Is there five? Is there six? Oops, I think that's still rocking from the five. Hmm. Can you confirm you have one daughter? Do you regret having to give her up? Are you glad she found you again? Definitely, yes, Shana. Is Is there a message that you want to give to any of our family members? No. No. Are you happy just watching over us? Making sure we're all okay? Definitely, yes. Thank you so much for interacting with us. 
We're going to call it a night. Yeah, thanks, Shannon's grandma. Thanks, Peg. <laughs> Have a good night. <laughs> Far out. <laughs> That's not Death. the messages that I expected to get. No, not this time. No, not not in this, not here, here, not in general. That's kind of cool. My <laughs> <laughs> elbows are killing. <laughs> <laughs> Can't believe Shannon. Yeah, the grandma comes through. <laughs> we yeah. we we know her and my so my nana and my poppy. Had interacted Should I stop with it? Will. Should I stop recording? No. No, it's yeah. okay. Um, so they've interacted with Will when he was a really little baby because he used to talk to something that was like six foot in the air and oh, yeah. another one that was really little. <laughs> oh, okay. <yeah. laughs> so it was like he was talking to them. Um, so we know they've been around. Yeah. But I've never got direct communication from any of them before. Wow. So that was kind of cool. Well, thank you, Peg. <laughs> And now, Sad, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> don't cry for me, Argentina. <laughs> All right, we'll call it off then. <laughs> um, so she hung on to make sure all of her family were all right. Yeah. She was sick for years and like clung on to make sure all her boys were looked after and everything. So there's no doubt in my mind that she's like, Hanging around <laughs> to make sure everybody's okay. <laughs> uh, get on your pig. Yeah, that's it, guys. We're done our investigation. What do you think of it tonight? Yeah, not as much activity as I thought we'd get, but. Um... Yeah, something very interesting happened just before we wrapped up. Yeah. As you can tell, Shannon's grandma came out of the pendulum, so. Yeah, we did one final little pendulum before we were packing up yeah. and um, got some pretty spot on answers, which was pretty cool. Yeah. Um, so let us know if you want to see more of that sort of stuff. Um, and we will, we will do our best to provide. Yes. Yeah. And that's the first time we use it. it. Yeah, we use it. We tried it on the live, of course, if you guys um, did check it out. Obviously, didn't quite work on it, but... Yeah, no one was wanting to interact with it before, but. Yeah. Um, yeah, later in the evening it came through. Yeah, so good stuff. So again guys, as I said before, if you like, like this video, share it out and subscribe if you haven't already. Um, the link to the merch store will be around, so yeah, down here, yep. And um, guys, I'll see you in the next one. Have a good night guys. What was down there? Ball. The ball? Yeah, you went to get the ball. What happened? The door. What happened? The door. There's a shadow in the door? Yeah. Yeah? Which door? Can you show me? Show me which shadow. Come on. I'll hold your hand. We'll hold your hand. No. No? So apparently, when Theo went to go get the golf ball that went down the hallway, there was a shadow that scared the absolute daylights out of him. He says, in the bathroom door.